This is your time. This is your season. And this is your moment. This is Dr. Tommy Campbell Jr. Welcome to another special edition of This is your time. This is your season. And this is your moment. I'm your certified life coach, your mindset coach, your motivator, your counselor, your inspirator. I want you to know that you are destined for greatness. Before I go any further, you know what I want to tell you. I want to tell you that I love you so much. I love you, I care about you, and I believe in you. And, and you know I always say this. I'm the type of motivational speaker that I like to build you up. I like to encourage you. I don't like to point out your flaws or put you down or make you look bad. I am here to inspire you. I am here to encourage you. I am here to motivate you. And most of all, I am here to empower you. And I want to tell you, you are beautiful. You are special. You are intelligent. You are smart. You are gifted beyond measure. You are loved. You matter. You are healthy. You are wealthy. You are blessed. You are a royal priesthood. You are gifted beyond measure. You are phenomenal. You are awesome. You are amazing. There is something magical about you. Do you realize there is magic? I am so serious when I say this. There is magic on the inside of you. And let me tell you this. I'm about to say something that's really going to bless you. I'm about to say something that's really going to inspire you and help you. You all don't realize. I want to see you all so successful. I want success for you all so bad. Listen to me very closely. I want to see you successful so bad. I want to see you accomplish your dreams so bad. I want you to blow up so bad. I want it so bad for you. And the question I want to ask you, do you want to become successful as bad as I want you to become successful? Because I want you to succeed as bad as you want to live. And if you want to succeed as bad as you want to live, then you'll be successful. I want to see that NFL team win the Super Bowl. I want to see that NBA team win the NBA championship. I want to see that Major League Baseball team win the World Series. I want to see that college football team win the NCAA championship. I want to see that basketball team, college basketball team, win the NCAA championship. I want to see you go back, that student go back and get your GED. I want to see you get your doctoral degree. I want to see you get your PhD, your master's, your bachelor's. I want to see you become a professional athlete. I want to see you start your YouTube channel. I want to see you write that book. I want to see you become the CEO of that company. I want to see you become a billionaire, a multi-millionaire. I want to see you come up with that billion dollar idea. Do you realize that you have a billion dollar idea on the inside of you? You have and you have listen, you have an idea in your mind that can literally blow you up and make you so successful. I will I want to see you be the lender and not the borrower. I want to see you be the first and not the last because the last shall be first. And the first shall be last. You are awesome. You are special. I know you have a story. I know you have pain in your life. Listen, I'm talking to somebody right now. I know you have pain in your life right now. I know you're an athlete and you had an injury that ended your season. I know you're in a, you're going through a divorce. I know you grew up without a father, grew up in a single mother home. I know you're sick. 
I know you're grieving because you lost a loved one. I know you're struggling with depression. I know you're, you're a sports team and you're having a losing season. I know you're in a toxic relationship. You want to get out of that relationship, but you don't know how. I know you're struggling right now. I know you're being abused. I know you have, have a negative mindset. I know you think negative. But, and, and you should be thinking positive, but you keep thinking negative. I know you keep failing. I know they keep rejecting you. They keep telling you no. I know you're going through something right now. But this brings me to the title of this motivational video. This is what I want you to do. I want you to start thinking your best. Think your best. Think positive. Don't focus on the problems. Don't focus on your problems. Don't put all of, listen, don't put all of your energy on the problem. Think your best. Think positive. Become solution driven. That's what I want you to do. I want you to become solution driven. You know my story. You know my story. I had every right to think negative. I had every right to give up on life. I flunked the first grade. I had a reading and comprehension problem. I had a learning disability. I was bullied in school. I was labeled as retarded. When I got in high school, my high school teacher, she put limited beliefs on me. She said I wasn't going to graduate high school. And then I tried to go to the military. And I remember this as I was taking that military exam. I kept hearing those limited beliefs in my mind. And then I flunked the military test. Then I finally got in college. But how many of you know the longer you live, life will happen. The longer you live, life will happen. I got sick in college and I had a nervous breakdown in college and I was hospitalized for a whole year and I flunked out of college. But guess what? I got back in on academic probation. Then in 2009, I became homeless with nowhere to live. But I thought my best in the midst of that. There were times in my life I wanted to quit. There were times in my life I didn't want to live. There was times in my life where I wanted to throw in the towel. I was so close to giving up on my life. I was so close to throwing in the towel. But there was something on the inside of me that would not let me quit. And I started thinking my best in the midst of my issues, in the midst of my pain, in the midst of my depression. I started thinking my best, and that's what I want you to do. In the midst of that divorce, in the midst of that pain, in the midst of your bad past, in the midst of that depression, in the midst of that divorce, in the midst of that sickness, I want you to think your best. And now, I'm a motivational speaker. I'm a published author of four self-help personal development books. I have a YouTube channel with over four, with over 700 plus motivational videos where for the past five years, listen, for five years, I have been getting in front of this camera for free for you all, for the whole world. Every single day, I do a video every day for five years for you all because I love you. And I want to help you. I want to see you accomplish your dreams. I want to see you deal with your pain, your depression, your issues. I'm here to help you. Think your best. There's something special about you. Listen, make a decision of what you want and how you will achieve it. Woo! I'm about to help you. I'm about to tell you how to get exactly what you want. This is what you do. This is how you get exactly what you want. I'm about to tell you. This is what you do. Number one, make a decision of exactly what you want and how you will achieve it. I'm going to say that again. This is how you get what you want. Do this. I want you to make a decision of what you want and how you will achieve it. Number two, I want you to work for your dreams. When you get your dream in your mind, whatever it is you want to do, whatever it is you want to be, whatever it is you want to become, I want you to work for your dreams. Listen, I'm telling you how to get exactly what you want. Think your best. Think your best. Number three, this is how you get exactly what you want. You have the ability to make your dreams a reality. That's what you need to know. Walt Disney started Walt Disney. He made it a reality. 
Mark Zuckerberg started Facebook. He made it reality. Jeff Bezos started Amazon. He made it a reality. Bill Gates started Microsoft. He made it a reality. Steve Jobs started Apple. He made it a reality. The YouTube owner started YouTube. He made it a reality. Warren Buffett started his company. He made it a reality. Elon Musk started his company. He made it a reality. You have the ability to make your dreams a reality. And listen, this is how you make your dream a reality. It's so simple what I'm about to tell you. Just get started. And after you get started, don't you quit until your dream becomes a reality. Get your dream in your mind and then put in the work to make your dream a reality. And then lastly, don't you stop until your dream becomes a reality. You need to know exactly what it is you want and then go after it. I'm still telling you how to get what you want. You need to know exactly what it is you want and then go after it. No matter how hard it gets, don't quit. There are going to be times in your life while you're going after your dreams, you are going to want to quit. But no matter how hard it gets while you're putting in that work, no matter how hard it gets while you're putting in the blood, no matter how hard it gets while you're putting in the sweat, no matter how hard it gets while you're putting in the tears, don't quit. Put in 120%. Listen, putting in 50, 60, 70, 80, 90%. That's not going to make your dreams a reality. This is what's going to make your dream a reality. It's when you give it all you got. It's when you put in 120%. Don't stop believing. We're talking about thinking your best. I want you to think positive. Think your best. You are what you think. Do you realize that? Do you realize you are exactly what you think? So don't stop believing. No matter how hard life gets. Yes, I know you have a past. Get rid of the ghost of your past. Stop looking back. Because if you look back, you're going to crash. But if you look forward, you're going to accomplish your dreams. Think your best. Don't stop believing. Principle number one. Don't allow people's negative thoughts break you or hinder you. That's what you need to know. Don't allow people's negative thoughts break you or hinder you. And number two. Don't allow people's negative thoughts about you break you or hinder you or stop you. People, you're going to have, there, there are people in your life, they're doubting you. They know you have dreams. They know you're dreaming big. They know you have aspirations. And there's people in your family, they don't believe in you. They're saying things like this. Oh, he's dreaming too big. That's the, he's that's too big for him to go after. Oh, why don't he just settle for something easier or smaller, or just go get a job uh, at a at just anywhere? Don't don't go after your dreams. No, don't allow people in your family. Don't allow your friends. Don't allow people's negative thoughts break you or hinder you. Now I know you got to do certain things for a season to get to where you're trying to get, and that's okay. But don't let people's thought, negative thoughts break you or hinder you. Principle number two. I want you to start thinking your best thoughts and making your best decisions. If you start thinking your best thoughts, if you start thinking positive, and make, you will make better decisions. Principle number three. I want you to come up with your greatest billionaire and millionaire ideas. I'm going to say that again. I'm trying to tell you how to get what you want. I want you to come up with your greatest billionaire and multi-millionaire ideas. Listen, in order for you to be able to think clearly, you are going to have to get out of that negative environment. In order for you to think clearly, you're going to have to get out of that toxic environment and get in a positive environment. And you're going to have to get in, get in an Watch this. I'm, like, I'm about to help you. You're going to have to get in, in an environment to where you can think clearly, to where you can meditate, focus, think clearly, so you can come up with the best idea that will change your life 
and it will bless everybody. Look, Mark Zuckerberg was in the right environment. He came up with Facebook. The YouTube owner was in the right environment. Come up with YouTube. Bill Gates was in the right environment. Come up with Microsoft. Elon Musk was in the right environment and he came up with this company. Get in the right environment. Get in a calm and get in a positive environment to where you can think clearly. Because remember, the title of this video is Think Your Best. And if you are going to think your best, you're going to have to be in the right environment. You can't be in a bad environment. You can't be in a toxic environment. You can't be in a negative environment and think your best. You got to be in the right environment. You got to be, watch this, here it goes. You have to be in a peaceful environment to come up with your best ideas that's going to change your life and the lives of others. Because the ultimate job is the ultimate position is for you to be so blessed that you will be able to bless other people. Principle number four. I want you to come up with the greatest ideas that will give you your best life. I want you to come up with the greatest ideas that will give you your best life. Principle number five. I want you to live your very best life before you leave this earth. Principle number six, and I'm closing. The right people in your life will never leave you even when you are at the lowest point of your life. And listen, when you are at the lowest point of your life, when you're struggling the most, that's when people will walk out of your life. While you're grinding, while you're putting in the work, while you're going after your dreams, nobody wants to be around you then. But when you start making a lot of money, when you, when you become successful, when you blow up and become successful, oh, everybody wants to be your friend then. But my question is, where were you when I was grinding? Where were you when I was working on my dreams? Where was you when I was in the lab going all out, working behind the scenes? Principle number seven. A champion is someone who tried one more time. Give it a try one more time. Think your best. This is your time. This is your season. This is your moment. Let me tell that athlete, you can accomplish your dreams and become a professional athlete. You can start that business. You can write that book. You can do it. You can be it. You can become it. This is your time. This is your season. This is your moment. There's something great about you. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Please spread the word all over social media about me as a motivational speaker. Please click the bell. You need to know I love you, I care about you, and I believe in you. This is your time. This is your season. This is your moment.